House of the Dragon was quickly given the green light for a second season after HBO viewers flocked to watch the Game of Thrones spin-off in their droves. One man who emerged as a pivotal figure was none other than Lord Corliss, played by Steve Toussaint, who'll be back for what's bound to be an almighty war between the Targaryens and Hightowers. However, with anticipation levels sky-high for season 2 to hit screens as soon as possible, Toussaint had poured cold waters on fans' hope that production is in full swing. I haven't actually seen any scripts yet, he said when asked about the second season of Hot. However, he added to extra a few tidbits of information to keep excitement levels rising. He went on, I've been told some good stuff's gonna happen. I think pretty much as is indicated at the end of this last season is the fact that he decided whatever I may think about Ranra, Emma Darcy, personally, she is the rightful heir to the throne. The land grab the high towers have done is treacherous, and they need to be made to pay for that. Plus. The fact is my grandson has been killed. Even though we know he is not my grandson, but he's my grandson. So, I think that's kind of where he's at, that that has to be paid for. Heading into season 2, it's clear Ranra has Corliss's support after he gave up his own plans to take the Iron Throne following Viserys's, Paddy Considine, death. However, the stage has been set for all-out war as Ran revise for her spot on the Iron Throne against the Hightowers, led by Alicent, Olivia Cook, and Otto, Resai fans, who also have a formidable backing. Corliss is now in sole charge of the Valerian fleet while Ranra and Demon, Matt Smith, also have the power of six dragons behind them. While they also have the allyship of a number of houses, the High Towers are backed by none other than Game of Thrones' formidable Lannisters. They've earned, or snatched, the allegiance of the King's Guard and City Watch while also harboring support from members of the Small Council as well. Season 2 will also have to address the fallout of Lucerys slash Luke's, Elliot Grehalt, death. But with Tucson still yet to even read the scripts, it seems fans are in for quite the wait until new episodes are filmed and brought to the screen. He won't be the only big-name star to reprise their role in Season 2 either. Darcy, Cook, iFans and the majority of the main cast will be back. However, it's unlikely Considine will return to House of the Dragon given Viserys' death in the first run. But with Hot and God no stranger to a time jump or flashback, fans may have a slim hope of seeing House of the Dragon's first king back on screens. House of the Dragon is available to stream on now now.